What do we got? Bourbon! We like bourbon. So this is Copper Craft Distillery out of Holland, Michigan. Yep. And this is their straight bourbon whiskey. Uh, what's the ABV on this one? 50. The ABV is 48.5. 48 48.5. So it's 97 proof. Okay. All right. You want to read? Well, pop you four? pop the cup. Yeah. And see if we get a... Pop the what? Pop the top. Oh, pop the top. I don't know what the hell you said. It's like, what? Eh. That was eh. okay. It was okay. Probably no glug glug. No, no, not really. Not with this shape. That's bottle though. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. A nice a nice one. Yeah, look at that. It's got like a little ringy dingy, too. A musical note. It did. It was nice. I was surprised. Pleasantly so, surprised. That's a heavy bottle. Yeah, it's a it's a, a statement bottle, right? That's nice. Put it prominently on your bar. Yeah, look at a little backlight. Look, it's even got like it's got like it's it's got yeah, like it's got the base base molding. Yeah, like as opposed to crown. I was gonna say crown molding, but I'm like it's got the crown. Yeah, base. So okay, what do you got on this? So this is uh, one of many products that they put out. Okay. And this is their straight bourbon. It's barrels of four plus and nine plus. What does that mean? And uh, the nine, the four-year-old barrels, uh, the four-plus years that they're distilling themselves, mm -hmm. and the nine-plus years are sourced. Oh, okay. So it's probably coming from Indiana, and the oh. fine folks that uh, we don't know that though, do we? but do we, uh, we don't know, and uh, they don't disclose the mash bills. Okay. But they do say they use a brandy blending and proofing technique, and it hmm. takes them three months to go from the barrel to the bottle. Interesting. So there's a lot of work involved. To put this okay. Together. All right. All right, well, let's go in and find out what this is all about. Did you say brandy? Cheers. A brandy technique. Not barrels, but a brandy technique. A brand oh, so I guess oh, the way like they blend uh, the barrels. What do you call that? Is there... What do you call that thing? Solera? Is this one? Yeah. Like a Solera? Like a Solera system. Ooh. Hmm. It smells kind of nice. It's a waft of, like, cherries at first. I don't hmm. know what that was. I don't know. Let me go back in. I, I, it kind of assaulted me. I think I've just been assaulted. I've been me too by the bourbon. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> Can I make that joke? Is that allowed? Cards and letters. No, I don't want cards and letters. Kilo. No cease and desist letters. None of that. Kilo. That's not the letters I'm going to get. Straining orders. No. So this is 48.5. Not terribly vapory. A little bit of vapors. Mm, it's got a little, little bit of vapors. Got a single. little bit of... You, you know it's supposed to be single, yeah. But it's not assaulting. At least for me, anyway. No, I got a little, little nasal assault. I got, I got like a little... Maybe a little cherry cola? Hmm. I don't know. I'm not getting any of that. So. Maybe a little orange? Huh. And some grains. I'm going in. See, I made I made a soup tonight that had for a second there I said cumin. I'm like, no, it's probably the cumin lingering in the house. No, oh, no. Yeah, I was actually thinking about that while I was making dinner. I'm like, it's gonna mess us up tonight. You shouldn't do that. Yeah, but eh, whatever. Hmm, that's pleasant. Yeah, I kind of like that. It's not real viscous. No, but, but it, it has some texture to it. it. But it, and it runs front to back. It's not just all up front. Hmm. Oh, I it actually has a nice finish to it. Too. Yeah, it does. Well, I gotta go back to this. It's nice. Chewing. So I'm doing chewing my whiskey. Mm. It's, it's got like a. And it's hot. Yeah, but not not overly. No. No, no, that's pretty but good. It, it lets I, you know it's whiskey. It's hot. It's nice. You know what? I like this. It's very caramely. Yeah. Very caramely. It's it's kind of. That, what was it saying? Like a cherry cola kind of yeah, thing? Yeah, that's but what I was saying. I got some cherry sort of, out of it. Sort of. Like a little, like a maraschino. You know that yeah. dark, dark cherry flavor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not like the little cracker yeah. maraschino. Yeah. The good, the real one. Uh -huh. The maraschinos, not the maraschinos. Mm -hmm. Not the one you throw on a Sunday. Exactly. Exactly. That's nice. It actually it tastes like, uh, mm. you know, it's four plus from their distillery and that's nine plus from a really source. Good. I like that. It, it tastes, it drinks uh, older mm. than that. It tastes older. Like more, like it's more nine plus than anything else. That's nice. You know what it's got? Well, depth. Yeah. Which I think is what you get with you know aging that you get a little more depth out of it. Because I get like on the back end, it gets a little dry. You get a little like like cinnamon or like a chili yeah. spice yeah, yeah, kind of thing. Yeah. But before that, I get like that cherry, almost like a like a man not a Manhattan, but more like like an old fashioned yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. You know. That's nice. I like that. I like the cocktail like that. with that. That's nice. Hmm. Mm. I bet that makes a mean Manhattan. Yeah, Manhattan. Well, Manhattan or it's a really that's good nice. old fashioned. Yeah, that's nice. Or anything, whatever. But that uh, it, that's a good whiskey. Mm. I may I may go I may go like ninety ninety one. Yeah, I'm thinking that that's I, I really that's, like that. That's, I'm very, that. that's an A minus. That's very close. I'm enjoying that. I'm a, I'm agreeing with you there. You're mm. a soft grader, but this in this case I'll agree with you. No, that's good. I like that. 
That's really, really nice. That's nice. They do a great job blending. Hmm. I think they're bringing together two good whiskeys to make a really great whiskey. That is in nice. In their straight bourbon. That's nice. And there's that little touch of sweetness. Yeah. But it's not overly sweet. No, no. no. That's, that's good. And I, I think you can get, I'm guessing, a little bit of a rye kick to it. With some Maybe. of that you know, sharpness. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. not so much that it's yeah. too much of that. Again, I don't know what the mash bill is. It doesn't taste like it's mostly corn. Right. There's sweetness, but then there's more to it. Like you said, there's depth. Hmm. I like it. That's good. Anyway, I'm sticking with my 91. Yeah. I like it. I'm agreeing with it. So. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is from Evans Communications with the fine folks that represent Copper, Copper Craft, Craft, and they yeah. sent us this bottle. So thank you to them. Thank you to Copper Craft for making a really nice whiskey. And uh, this is a keeper. It's Road trip. Keeper. Let's do it. Michigan. Road trip. Well, you know what? I'm going to be in, be in Chicago. See how close? Well, that's Wisconsin. That's it. Is it the other side of the lake? Michigan. I know, but no, so but I'm saying it's the other side of the lake, though. Yeah. Right? I don't know how close that is. Maybe it's worth the trip. Well, I'm thinking Wisconsin's right above Illinois, so I got to go around the lake. Yeah. All right, I'll go around the lake. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers.